from Indy's streaming news leader. This is a WRTV update. There are now nearly two dozen new probationary IMPD officers ready to protect and serve the community. Friday, the 23 members of the 28th recruit class graduated from the Training Academy and received their badges from Mayor Joe Hogsett and IMPD Chief Chris Bailey. They just completed 28 weeks of classroom and situation based training and will begin their field training serving the city of Indianapolis. What do I expect from you as your chief of police? But more importantly, what does the community we serve expect from you? You need to be compassionate, dedicated, empathetic, thoughtful, honest, trustworthy and selfless. You will put yourself between good and evil at great risk to your own safety. But that is what we do. There are 18 men and five women in this class. They will now go through 20 weeks of training in the field. Now to a major money move that could help volunteer firefighters better protect their communities. The Indiana Volunteer Firefighters Association received $10 million to help replace old gear and form new training centers. There's certainly a need for this money. Volunteer firefighters are responsible for most of the state. There are 850 departments operating on their own time and dime. We don't have the fire people that can come out in the rural areas and we need them. They're very important. A lot of people don't realize that they're a volunteer. Most of them don't get paid and um, they're a blessing to everybody. The Indiana Firefighters Volunteer Association did legislative work and vouched for this funding. For more stories and weather that you need to know, download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.